So I designed this in SOLIDWORKS and for reference I was inspired by the Sunlu Wash and Cure Station. But since I wanted it to be cheap, I designed it mostly using laser cut acrylic and 3D printed parts. For the front I used clear acrylic while the rest is built from 2 mm and 5 mm thick white acrylic. I put all the electronics in the bottom compartment to keep things neat. On the back there's a DC jack for a 12 volt adapter and a power switch. For the motor I went with a Pancake NEMA 17 mounted on a thin acrylic sheet supported by spacers. The motor is connected to a plate with two magnets which will later rotate the washing or curing plate. For the UV light I used three 12 volt UV LED strips. On the front I mounted a rotary encoder for mode selection an e-paper display and two white LEDs as indicators. All these parts are mounted to the acrylic using 3D printed brackets with snap fit joints. Now here's an exploded view of the final design. First I sliced the 3D printed parts using Creality Slicer. Since the build volume is tiny I had to split it into 5 prints. After printing, I washed the parts in a very primitive way and then cured them under the sun. Next, I exported the laser cut parts to DXF and sent them to a local shop for cutting. I assembled the enclosure first to stop any further work.
Make sure you put the magnets with opposite polarity. And here it is the final assembly. The original reason I bought the resin printer was to print cool figures, but since I'm broke, I decided to design my own figures. I made one of Malenia from Elden Ring. Well, it's kinda bad because my laptop is a potato. It crashed like five times when I tried to subdivide the mesh for higher resolution. So here's my low poly masterpiece.
took longer than I expected to cure, but hey, it worked. And here's the final result.